Hey, what's up, guys? How's everybody doing today? We got a lot of people here. Let's see. Give me a one if you can hear us. Type one. I can hear you, coach. Let's see who is ready to make some money. Can you hear us? Are you awake? Excellent, excellent, awesome, cool, cool. So today we're going to have an amazing training. We've been having amazing results from newbie students who's never made money on Amazon. And, uh, and, and our goal is for you to make your first sale online with Amazon. Yes. First question is, who would like to learn how to make Couple million in sales with Amazon today. Let's say, give me a, give me a one, number one if you would love to learn this. Let's see, is it life proof? Look at that, twenty percent, man, of your sales on on kitchen furniture. Wow, man, this is awesome. Yes, cool, cool. Go, me, Lou. Let's hey, change hey. lives. How are you guys doing today? Uh, you guys know it. Thank you for that introduction. And that's um, our Amazon account. We've been drop shipping products for like over two years now. And uh, we've been teaching students for over a year. But luckily, uh, I found out about Johnny and how he uh, uh, can teach others, uh, promote um, of these kind of programs to others. So you know, I reached out to him and I told him about, hey, you know, your students can make money really easy on Amazon, and you know, we're just using a very basic, simple method of reselling products with actually without owning any product. But first, and I'll show you guys my 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 history, right? My little story here. You know, I, I wasn't all this uh, successful before. Uh, this is me right on the left. Um, I used to go to a community college, and you know how long it took me to get a two years degree. It took me 10 years to get a two years degree, guys. Oh my God, I, man, you were dumb, huh? I, I was really dumb and stupid. <laughs> and, but, you know, I, I was trying to figure out life. And life uh, in college wasn't for me because, you know, for some reason, you know, it just didn't work out for me. You know, I thought that I'm going to be stuck in a dead end job forever. And, uh, you know, at the bottom left, I was a, a security guard. I was a security guard for a, a, a Fortune 500 company here in uh, Cupertino, California. So if you guys don't know about the traffic here, the traffic sucks. I mean, I would get to work like it took me. It would take me an hour to get to work in traffic, and then it would take me an hour to get back back home. And I hated traffic so much, guys. I spent like like 13 years doing a security job. You know, so I really disliked that job and. This one day, um, my my back started to ache. That was about about two or three years ago, and you know I I just I just couldn't handle it anymore because you know the, the traffic and the work it just it just hurt my back. And at that time, um, I I got got married. I got married with my wife, and here's our two son, and here in this picture. And I knew that you know this this way of of working is not it's not going to work out. It's not working out because I'm stuck at a job I don't like. And uh, getting shitty pay that I didn't want, so I had to find a way to get out of that. Uh, here's my paycheck from 2003. It was about over $35,000. I mean, if you guys don't know about that. That's like lower, low minimum wage, right? <laughs> that's how how much I got paid for doing a security work. And you know, for surviving in California with you know two two kids and wife, that's that's never enough. So I had to figure out something. I had to figure out something, and I had to search the internet and trying to find uh, work, trying to find a way to make money. And at this time, I found like uh, I started out as uh, doing network marketing. And you know, here's my first check I got from it. It was thirty-eight dollars and fifty cents, and it took me months and months to get this amount. And I told myself, why is this so hard? Why do I have to recruit people? Uh, why do I have to talk to people? And uh, to get them to join um, some program, you know, that people then have other people join their program to make money. Uh, luckily, my friend introduced me into a business called dropshipping. Uh, I first started out on on eBay, 
Okay, this was on, on eBay. I made like uh, almost six thousand dollars in sales on eBay, and I started hearing about Amazon. Okay, Amazon was really big back then, but you know I finally like moved over to Amazon, and then this is our first day for one day sales. We did almost three thousand dollars in a day. So at that point, I just told myself that hey, I need to really focus on Amazon because it's making more money than eBay. Um, and we started working on Amazon, and then all of a sudden, I was making uh, a couple hundred to a couple of thousand dollars a month, and then like three times as much I was, I was work, working as my uh, security job. And one day, I just told my my wife, "Hey, you know, I don't want to work security anymore." And this is the text message that I sent to her. You know, I only work there a couple of days a week because I was working this part time, and then you know, I just finally. Hey, I need to focus on on Amazon and make this a full time business. So then I start working from home, and uh, I'll show you guys exactly what we do. Okay, so we sell on Amazon using a drop shipping method. So this is the, our complete business model right here. So we act as a reseller. We'll find products that we can sell for a profit, and then we'll list that products for sale on Amazon. And during that time, we don't do any advertising or marketing at all. Amazon does all of that for us and get the customer for us. So once uh, we put that on for sale on Amazon, a buyer will purchase that item from us, from our store, and then that money goes into our Amazon account. And then it takes two weeks for that money to go into our bank account, but during that time, we'll place an order for that item with the supplier, and the supplier will ship that item out directly to the buyer, and we profit the difference after the fees. Okay, so give me a one if you understand that business model. It's very much simple, right? You find products, you put it on for sale, and once it's sold, you order the product with your money, and uh, the supply will ship it out to the buyer directly. And two weeks later, you get paid from Amazon. Okay, so that's the main point of it. Um, let's go into our training. So. Um, I'll show you guys how to make an Amazon account. Okay, how you guys like that? You want to know how to make an Amazon account? Give me a one if you want to, two if you don't. All right. Let's see who's awake. Everybody's sleeping. We go home. Give me a one. Give me a one. Yes. Let's see who's who's ready. Who's ready? Right, and I'll show you guys how to uh, find those items. Okay, cool, Scott said, let's go. Uh, you said, says, yes, let's do it. All right, cool. So we'll show you guys how to make an Amazon account. They have two different accounts. The first one is called an individual one, and the second one is called a professional account. What it means uh, for the individual account is you plan on selling 40 items a month or less. Um, there's some uh, additional fee to it, which is 99 cents per sale, including the commission fee. Usually, uh, Amazon charges us 15% commission once an item is sold. And the individual plan, they'll add 99 cents per sale to it. For the professional plan, this means we sell more than 40 products. If we sell 40 products, then that means we're break even on our, our fee. This is a 39.99 a month fee. Uh, for this plan, but if we sell 41 items, we actually make a dollar profit. So, you know, we sell more than that, we'll, we'll make more profit we're being on this plan um, instead of the individual plan. So, creating an account, really easy. Go into your sellercentral.amazon.com and click on register now. Once you get there, sometimes Amazon will offer a free trial on a professional plan. If not, you can get signed up for the individual plan. Uh, you click on Start Your Free Trial or sign up for the plan. It will bring you into this screen. Uh, you can use your uh, Amazon account that you have now or just create a new one with your new uh, email address. And you will have your first name, email address. You create a password um, and plug in the image uh, keywords. The next one is a legal name. This is going to be your name or the business name. Continue. The next one is the sell information. Um, first is the display name. This this is your store name. What the customer will see once they buy a product from your store. 
So I recommend having like a general store name so you can sell any anything, but it doesn't really matter. Okay, you can make the store name store one two three five. It doesn't matter. Okay, um, your address and your phone number, save and continue. Credit card information. This is where Amazon will uh, verify your identity. So uh, have your credit card the same billing address with with um, with your billing address. Uh, put that in, continue, and then verify your identity by adding your phone number. Okay, you put in your phone number here. You can either have Amazon call you or send you a text with a PIN, and you put in your PIN here and verify your PIN. Continue. Next is going to be your tax identity information. It's going to launch the interview wizard, and this is pretty much self-explanatory. It asks you some personal questions. Uh, when you save and finish you're going to be locked in into your seller central. That means uh, inside your, your uh, back office of your, where you do all the selling. So, you know, you won't have all these numbers, but it will be all zero, and this is where we start. The, the most important thing is the shipping setting. This is where a lot of people get wrong, like 98% of people, and you may end up losing money. So you want to set up a shipping uh, um, settings correctly by going to settings on the top right and the drop down menu shipping settings and here will bring you to this screen if you're from uh, from a different country you can use the uh, shipping from the US zip code just find any zip code put that in on top but mostly you guys from the from the US so click on change to shipping model and for shipping model click on price bandit Continue, and here's the most important thing. You just want to check on three to five business days for the continental U.S. street. Okay, when you log in, a lot of these are going to be checked, so you want to uncheck that and only check the standard three to five business day continental U.S. street. All right, because the reason is, uh, if we ship to, for example, Alaska, that's going to cost you a lot of money to ship to Alaska. You know. So skip that step and put it right on, on that one. Next one, for the shipping rate, uh, you want to put that at zero. We're going to offer free shipping for our customer. It makes the, um, the customer more likely to buy, and it's a way that we can, uh, we can price it correctly, easier. All right, next page. And I'll, I'll show you guys some live example right now of profitable products that you can actually list on Amazon in your account. And then uh, I'll show you guys even how to list it and how to find these kind of products, okay? So let's go ahead and check this out. I'm at Amazon right now, and this is a, um, a file drawer, right? It's sell on Amazon for um, $114.90, but on Walmart, as you see, this is the same picture right here. It's selling for $73.29 plus free shipping, okay? So you see the price difference, right? You see the price difference? And, and now we want to know how do we calculate the profit we can make, okay? So let's go ahead and pull up our fee calculator, our, our calculator, and we want to know the outdoor cost on Walmart, or another business term called is uh, the cost to acquire. Okay, so we'll take $73.29, we multiply that by 1.09. So the one is going to be for the price, and the 0.09 is going to be for the tax. So Walmart charges tax on all the states. Some states are higher than others. So we use a tax from high state, like California, where I'm at. It's like 9%. So uh, we multiply that, and we'll get the price after tax, or, um, or the total price, or the cost to acquire, because this has free shipping. Okay, This is how much we'll, um, we'll, we can get the product for after everything. Okay, so the next thing we'll do is we'll find an Amazon fee calculator. So we'll type this in, Amazon fee calculator on Google. We'll search for this. It's an easier way for you guys to get to the calculator. And you want to click on this one right here, e-commerce buy fee calculator for Amazon. Okay, click on that. And it will bring you to this screen right here as the fee calculator. The next thing when you're here is you want to check on the right category. Okay, we're in the books right now, so for uh, how to find out the category, we'll go back to Amazon, and over here, this is the category, furniture, home, and kitchen. 
right? So let's go back over here and find something near it. So this is going to be home and garden. Whatever it has a, um, a title on there, home. The next thing we'll do is copy the price after the calculation, right? The cost to acquire right here from Walmart and we'll paste it on here. Cool. And the item price, that's going to be from Amazon. So we copy this. How much is Amazon selling it for? And we'll paste it here. And that gives us a total profit of $16.34. Okay? Is that, is that cool or what? Tell me one. Give me a one if you said that it's cool. And you know what? We don't actually buy this product beforehand. We find this product right now, like we're doing, and then we list this product for sale here. So as you can see, this is shipped and from and sold by this store, right? Rose product and source. When you list a product on here, you get shipped from and sold by your store on here or my store on here. Okay, once a buyer comes onto this page, they buy from you, and then you will get an email saying that, hey, this product that you, uh, you put on Amazon just sold, go ahead and ship this out, right? And then after that, you go on to this website, the supply Walmart, add this product to your cart and process an order. And uh, for the shipping um, address, you put the buyer shipping address and it will be in your Amazon, uh, Amazon uh, back office, okay? You guys want to see another one? Give me a yes if you guys want to see another one. So I have a couple here. One, two, three, four, five, something like that. So if you guys want to see more proper products, and I'll give me a yes. And I'm going ahead and um, put on these links into the chat box for you guys. Okay, here we go. Uh, yes, yes, cool, cool. So here's another one. Here's a TV stand, okay? They're selling Amazon for $57.99. Let's go over to uh, Walmart. And Walmart is selling for $32.41. All right, let's do, go ahead and do some calculation to get the total price. Uh, 32.41, we'll multiply that by 1.09. We get thirty-five dollars and thirty-two cents. That's after tax. But for this one, we need to also add sh uh, shipping. That's shipping, free shipping, only products that are over fifty dollars. So how we get uh, the shipping price? Go down here and click on the shipping option. Okay. You can put in any uh, zip code, and here it is. The cost is going to be five ninety-seven. So we'll add that into this five ninety-seven. We get $41.29 as the out the door price or the cost to acquire. And we'll go back to our fee calculator and plug those numbers in. So with this business, it's all about the numbers and the products. Okay, guys? Uh, cost to acquire for $129. We'll go back to Amazon, copy this, and paste that here. So that's $6.55 profit. Right? Imagine you're selling like 20, 30 of these a day. So let's go ahead and uh, I'll show you another product. This is going to be a higher profit, uh, profit product. This is going to be a sofa. It's selling on Amazon for $425.26. Cool. Uh, but on Walmart, it's selling for $184.29 plus uh, $34.78 shipping. Let's go ahead and do our calculation. And 184 to 9, multiply that by 1.09 to get the price after tax, and then we add the shipping charge of uh, $34.78, and we get $235.65 as the cost to acquire. We'll go over here, we'll paste that here, then we'll go back here on Amazon and we'll get the price, and we'll paste that onto the price. So this product is sold for a profit of $124 right here. Okay, so who wants to know how we would look for these products uh, on Walmart? Of course, in our program, we teach you other suppliers to use, but for now, you know, we just use Walmart for uh, for the example. Okay, so if you if I see a yes, if you guys want, let me show you guys uh, the method that we use to search for these products on Walmart. Give me a yes, and we can get started.
Yes, yes. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so I'll show you a quick and easy method. First, you go to Amazon, and then we'll open up Walmart also, okay? So what we do is, you know, we can browse in different departments that we can sell in. Uh, usually it goes to home, home and kitchen, things like that. And, and we will find a product listings that has a lot of products, okay? So let's go in here, uh, bakeware, uh, let's go to dining and see our dining and entertainment. More stool, tools and glasses, all right. Cool, so these are the products right here. We got some best sellers and things like that and we had like over a million products right here. So basically what we do is we look for products on Amazon first. And we look for product that doesn't have these prime local. So usually prime local means that Amazon is selling it, so we're not likely to meet the price. Uh, we'll look for that. For example, this one right here, we'll open that up. And we'll copy the title. And simply, we just go to Walmart and search for it. And we'll search for a title. Usually it's on the first page. If it's not on the first page, then it's not likely it's going to be on here. And then after that, if we find a proper product, we just use the calculation again, right? So let's go ahead and go back, and we just look for products without a farm logo. Okay, all these all has a farm logo. Let's go real fast. Next page, and next page. Let's find one more. This is too low. Here's another one right here without the Prime logo. We'll just copy this and paste on to uh, Walmart. Let's see if we can find it for a profit. Okay, so that's the method that we use. Uh, just one method out of like four methods that we use to search for our products with other suppliers and so on. And uh, do you guys want me to show you guys how to list these products that I found on to Amazon? I'll send you guys here's okay let me log into uh, my markup account and I'll show you exactly how we list these products onto Amazon okay so we so this is one of our markup Amazon account uh, let me see if I can okay cool 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 I'll put that in here for a little bit easier anyway so the thing we do, how we list these products is, well, we, we log into Amazon account, we go to inventory, and add a product. And we're gonna ask for the ASIN. So the ASIN is what we can find on Amazon right here. We we'll scroll down. It's gonna be either on the left or the right side of the product information. Right here is the ASIN. We we'll just copy that, and we'll paste it here. Okay, and we do a search, and it, if this button is yellow, it says sell yours, that means we can sell this product, okay? So click on that, and we want to go to advanced view. Okay, quantity, we're going to use one. Condition, new. The price, we know that, you know, we can sell that for a profit, so we just beat the price by a cent. So that means we'll sell that two, 25, 25, and we're going to be at the lowest price. The production time, this is um, this is like the most important thing. So we want to know how long does it take for uh, for the supplier to ship out an order once we place that order. Okay, um, it's another another word calling for like um, latency time or handling time. Okay, so we we'll go back to Walmart. And the way we find out is clicking on the shipping option right here. See this it says it arrives. That means it will be uh, it will arrive to our customer home at uh, January 13th, okay? So let's pull out our calendar and I'll show you guys how exactly we'll figure that out. So January 13th, it's gonna be right here. What we want to account for is we want to account for five days delivery time. So we'll take uh, January 13th, we'll count backwards for five days delivery time. One, two, three, four, five, and we land on January, January 8th. 
and then we'll start from January 8 and we'll count backwards to today. That, and that will give us the production time or the handling time. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six days. All right, so we'll pull up our this again and we'll use six days. And the minimum we'll go is three days only. If anything goes less than three days or two days, one day, then we'll use our three days as the minimum. And then we'll save and finish. Right here is going to be listed. It's going to take a couple minutes. Let's go ahead and refresh. And here it is. All right, this is inactive. Refresh again. And this is active. Now it's in our store. It's ready to sell, ready for a buyer to come and buy this product. Okay. How you guys like that? Give me a, a yes if you guys like it. And how do you guys like if I show you guys how to process an order once you get a sale? Yes, cool, cool. All right. So when you, uh, once you receive a sale from uh, Amazon, uh, you're going to get an email saying that, hey, this order has uh, been sold. Go ahead and ship out this order, okay? After that, you want to log into your Amazon account, uh, go to your orders and your manage orders. Okay? This is where you're going to see all your orders. And here's what it's going to look like. And you want to click on the order number. When you click on the order number, it will bring you to the order detail page where you, you get your buyer's phone number, address, uh, and name. This is what you're going to need to place an order uh, for that product. Okay. So next one, for example, we, uh, if we were to sell this uh, Altamont, we just add this to our cart, uh, do a checkout, and then for the shipping, we use uh, the free shipping or the lowest price shipping and then continue for the entered shipping address this is the M address this is the buyer address that you get from Amazon uh, first name last name phone number street address and then the next page is going to be your payment method this is going to be your name your credit card and your billing address and your phone number okay you put one put it in there and then uh, yes review your orders and submit and that's it that's how you process an order it's like you're shopping online, except that you're making money instead of you know, buying a product. So another thing is your account health. Okay, this, your account health is really important. Uh, it means that Amazon uh, wants good seller selling on here. Uh, they track the, um, the performance based on a couple of matrix. Okay, the first one is a customer service performance matrix, uh, shipping performance, product policy violation and so on. You can view more details when you log into your Amazon account. All right? um, and I want to show you guys some testimonials. This is uh, Cy Karen. Uh, this is just yesterday. He made some sales, four days sales. Um, Johnny, yes. I'm do you here. want to talk about our testimonials? Yes, yes. I mean, we have this, uh, this, this student, you know, who joined you know, uh, not too long ago, and, and after four, day, four days, you know, uh, he sends me a message, man, thank you so much for the awesome training, Coach Johnny. you know, I made my first, you know, my first money online, you know, the guy was super excited, but the most uh, interesting thing is we hear a lot of people from the United States saying, I don't have money, I don't have money, uh, and this guy is from India, <laughs> India, <laughs> Uh, it's not even third world country, right? And he found the money, he joined, he made his sales, and he's not making excuses, you know? And I know I keep telling about my story, but this story is even better. <laughs> you know, he's from India, right? So yeah. it was just impressive, you know, that someone from India was hungry and, and, uh, and living in a third world country did not stop him from finding success. And uh, a lot of people, you know, here make the excuse: I don't have money, I don't have money, I don't have money. But you, you live in a in the first in one of the best countries in the world. You know, if you really want to find the money, you will find the money for for good coaching. So uh, yeah. it was just, you know, uh, I guess uh, very, very interesting how someone who really wants to do it will find a way, right? 
Yep, exactly. You want to get something done, you want to improve your life, you should find a way. Just like I found a way. I just searched the internet and, and I didn't even find it on there, but my friend introduced me to something that, that worked. And it's so simple. We're just selling products that people want already, you know, just regular products around the house, and we're making money off it. We're not just going out and making new products or anything like that. Yeah, cool. What is the other testimony? Okay. Eric. Oh, Eric made money already. Wow. First product. Yep, he just joined. Product. Wow, yeah. 615 dollars. Uh, he just started as well. Like, uh, what we're trying to show you guys is uh, I know that Min has been doing it for a couple of years, right? But uh, anyone can make money. <laughs> anyone can make money. So uh, you just have to uh, have the desire to to want to learn and the desire to have a good program and not try to figure it out on yourself when you can, you know, hire someone who already made the mistakes, which is in this case uh, Min, who you already made to probably, you know, a uh, million dollars in mistake, right? <laughs> Yeah, I made a lot of mistakes, and I know the in and outs of Amazon and so on. Uh, so it's easier for you guys just to get started uh, and learn from from the expert. You know, learn from the expert on how to get um, to get your selling and get out out of all the mistakes because it's going to cost you thousands of dollars uh, if those mistakes are are based on your own understanding of it. You know, or tens of thousands of dollars. Um, so here's Karen. Okay, it's just recently yesterday she sent me a picture. Uh, five sales, five hundred eighty-four dollars. Um, it's Robert. So you guys wow. know about Robert? Go ahead. Robert Sislo works with Grant Cardone. Uh, it, he he also started taking action, made made some money, and uh, now he's going for the million dollars. He actually made uh, over a thousand in sale in a month. Oh wow! Uh, he made more sales. Yeah, he made more sales. Uh, this is an old picture of this, but yep, he made more sales. Uh, I gotta get a new one. So here's a uh, Ozzy. This is in California, just like me. Here's her sales. Um, this is what he's getting more sales each and every day. Here's Ryan. Okay, two thousand six hundred dollars. Wow, Ryan okay. made money. Here's his Simon. He's making some money, two sales a day. This is on uh, the twenty eighth. He's making more sales. Here's uh, Juan Walker. He's one of our best students. All right. So this is back in. Uh, November 26th, and he uh, just started a couple weeks, and he just went up to uh, $5,854 in sale in a week. And we'll go to the next one. This is a, a weekly process progress report he sent me, and it's great because you can see his improvements. On 11:28, he did over $9,000 and uh, in sales with $1,200 in profit. Can you guys imagine making a thousand dollars and two hundred dollars? Oh, a thousand two hundred dollars in, in profit in a week. In a week, I mean. And that's, he just started, uh, and, and just a couple of weeks ago. He, he just started, man. He, that was more than I made in corporate America every week. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah. That was much more than I made too. <laughs> so here's December fifth. You know, this is the next following week. Uh, Nine thousand, uh, over a thousand dollar in profit again. Uh, his December 11, 16, he actually made over 10,000 in sales, almost $1,500 in profit. Okay. Uh, here's uh, December 19, $11,000 in sales for a week, and almost $1,500 in profit again. Here is, he is on uh, the 26th. This is his 73 uh, days into the program, and he did $50,000 in sales. Wow. Right, and all his sales, fifty thousand dollars in sales, only made in the last forty-five days. This is he sent this to me about uh, last week, and here he is. Uh, he sent me this to me yesterday. So it's his first day ever of reaching three thousand dollars in sale. Wow! In one day. In one day. Wow! So he's close to do hundred thousand dollars in sales. Yep, he's close to it, and he's going to get a T-shirt. Uh, so. You know this program is is a, a amazing program because you know because um, all the students are having success. You know people are getting sales and profit, and um, you know we offer a mastermind program uh, just for for you guys right here exclusively to um, to the millionaire mastermind. Okay, uh, what this includes is includes how to find 
products even faster and with more suppliers uh, than what we're showing you today. We'll show you guys 10 proper products that you can list Monday to Friday into a group. Uh, we'll show you guys how to keep your account in great shape and get even more sale because Amazon is all almost like a lot based on your account, your account health, you know, your customer service. And uh, we include 10 additional suppliers you can use to make profit every single day. Uh, how, we'll, one thing that you know, other callers don't ever tell you about is how, how you can find new suppliers. That new suppliers that they, other people don't even really know about and you can only sell, uh, and you can sell that product over and over and over again. Another thing is how we outsource everything. 95% of the work to uh, VAs, virtual assistant, and paying them as low as $150 a month. So basically, uh, you know, at the beginning, I was just like one. I was working part time, uh, three to four hours a day, just like one. That's what he was working, and he is working right now. And uh, and then um, it hit me. I need to uh, hire people to work for me. So I found a way to hire the VA's virtual assistant to work for me, uh, and then do and do all the work, all the searching products, placing orders and inventories, and so on, everything. And I'm, I'm just sitting here, I'm not doing much. So, you know, here's, here's my daily routine, guys. I'm gonna show you guys my, my daily routine. is like uh, waking up in the morning, uh, checking my emails, checking my store, you know, look at the numbers, uh, checking my credit cards and bank account, and chatting with my VAs just a little bit. So some days, um, I just work like a couple minutes a day and let all my, my, my team do all the work, you know? So how do you guys like, like to do that kind of job? You know, uh, at, at some point, be able to do that kind of job. Tell me if you guys uh, want to or not. Well, anyone, you know. Uh, I think uh, if you're afraid of spending money on traffic and testing and all that, this is the perfect business. It's a perfect business for you to start getting uh, confident that you can make money online and, and then, you know, uh, save some money and then maybe you can start pushing uh, uh, traffic, right? Uh, which requires more risk and and the most important thing and this is why our mastermind is worth what is worth it's not a course it's not just some videos you're buying the brain of someone who does millions and and he's going to teach you how you can uh, build a team so you can automate this money so you can focus on whatever you want to do you know and, and we as you can see Everyone is having success. Uh, I mean, we can we cannot say 100% guarantee success, but I will say 100% guarantee success for everyone who takes action, right? Yeah, I mean, I'll show you guys this 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 my uh, my work schedule. Like, you know, I check my emails, check I check the store, I check the credit card, I check the bank, I check whatever Facebook. That's different, and that's all I do. That's the my daily routine right there. You know, that's my uh, CEO daily routine. Uh, and, um, you know, and I'll show you guys how to make 10% of your cost. So, for example, if you place an order on a Walmart for $100, right, I'll show you guys how to get $10 doing the same thing that you're already doing. And we'll uh, show you guys the software that we use to automate our business. And then you guys have also direct contact to me to answer all your questions. We do a, a weekly uh, webinar, a Q&A webinar every Monday. Um, you know, just for the mastermind, uh, I answer every, every question you guys have, the VAs, how to outsource, how to find products, all kind of things. And another bonus is uh, me and Juan actually made a new recording on how he was able to bring it up his account so fast. And that's going to be in the, the member area also. Uh, um, yeah, that training from Juan is, is amazing and he, he shows you uh, how he actually started and how he uh, done over fifty thousand dollars in the for only the, in the past seventy three days starting the program. Yes, awesome, man. Uh, and he was a newbie. Uh, mm -hmm. He didn't he didn't know what he was doing on Amazon at all. Zero. Never made a, a dollar. You know, and and uh, I put him as a as a case study for me uh, because I knew he w was going to take action, and and he did and. You know, now he's helping other students to become successful. He even creates videos and, and, and participates. So go guys to the ecomshortcut.com if you're interested in having 
a good program where you finally are going to have success online. Uh, pretty much, I'm going to say guarantee success for everyone who takes action. Okay? The ecomshortcut.com. If you're interested in being on the best mastermind in the planet, you know, we are uh, creating lots of stories, success, uh, literally zero refunds. <laughs> you know, uh, people are very happy. And we're also going to meet at the end of the month. At the end of the month, we're going to have a meetup in Orlando. If you want to be part of the mastermind and meet the Millionaire Mastermind team, we're going to be in Orlando. We're going to have a party all for free if you're part of the mastermind. So if you want to meet Coach Johnny, Coach Rafael, you know, uh, want to meet us and party with us, uh, this is the best opportunity for you. Cool. So we got some questions here, uh, Gian. Let me go and answer them. Uh, Scott asks, when placing orders uh, at the third-party site, does this trigger file alert on the credit card since you're making dozens of transactions on card at the same place? Uh, sometimes that happens, but all it takes is a phone call and then, you know, hey, I just placed this order. Um, you know, you, um, go ahead and approve it and then we'll release the, the fraud charge or whatever. But that's, that's rare. That's rare. Uh, it's like a five minute phone call. Uh, another question is also what happens if the vendor sold out after you have a bunch of orders in Quarry? Does that hurt your Amazon health if you have to cancel all those orders? Uh, first of all, you know, we try to have not have, have that happen in the first place uh, by using our method. And then if it does, then we offer some method and techniques uh, to have you know, like the buyers to cancel the order. Uh, and really important, yeah, if you have to cancel a lot of orders, then that's going to hurt your account, but we try to not, not ever get into that point by using your method. Uh, Victor asks, when there's a sale on Amazon, uh, do I have to pay for the product first and then wait to get paid uh, by Amazon after two weeks? That, that is exactly right, Victor. That is exactly right. Uh, Joseph, uh, Joseph asks, I hope you I pronounced your name already, uh, right? Um, so with this business model, how do you deal with customer returns of a product? Um, the customer returns actually goes back directly to the supplier, so you don't have to do with any returns. Uh, the return won't go to you; it goes back to the supplier, and we'll teach you how uh, to set that up. All right. So, if you guys have any questions, go ahead and ask. Uh, meanwhile, when you guys are asking, I'm going to send these products to your chat box, and you can list these products today when you set up your Amazon account. Okay. Any more questions, guys? So I'll go over some couple more products. Here's a bookcase selling Amazon for $120.50. Uh, Walmart selling for $69.79. Send that in for the chat box for you guys. All right. Next one is going to be a uh, accent table selling Amazon for $97.28. On Walmart, selling for $24 right here. Oh, this is actually a white one. So is there a white one? This is a white one right here. All right, $23. There's some shipping charge. So any other question, guys? I'll finish this up. Uh, here's a, uh, a drawer, right? Selling for $114.90. On Walmart, it's selling for $73.29. And we have another question. Wayne asks, what does your program cost? So you gotta make an appointment and the strategy coach will actually tell you the price of the program. And here's a TV stand selling on Amazon for $83.99. The same one sells on Walmart for $34.04. Okay. And here's, here's the last one. This is a bigger one. This is a furniture set, right? It's selling for Amazon for $1,048.23, but on Walmart, it's selling for $499.99. So this is a big profit maker, about, about $300 or so profit. And this is product in the sale already. Any other question, guys? So if there's no more questions, go ahead and go to the ecomshortcut.com. Here's what it's going to look like when you, you go to the site. 
test loading, loading. We'll refresh that. And then you know, put in your the time zone and next and schedule an appointment with our strap T coach. Okay, put in there, put in a time, next, and then you'll be set up with a call. Uh, cool, I think that's it for questions. That's it, that's it. Thank you guys for coming to this uh, webinar and hope you guys uh, put these items up for sale. Sell a lot of these and uh, let me know. Send uh, me a message or Johnny and let me know once you sold and make money on these products. Okay, guys? Love to see it. Yeah, love it, love it. Thank you so much, man. Have a Thank wonderful you. night. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.